I've been looking through my notes that I took at an event here in the European Parliament last week and it was all about community living and I was very happy to host that meeting. But many, many people throughout Europe and indeed in Ireland do not have a home. Many with a disability are forced to live in institutions and we really need here in the European Union to stop that. I've worked on it for a long number of years and we are making progress. So and when did we change the regulation? I can't remember the date. I remember making a speech saying, wow, we've done this. It was fantastic that moment that we changed the regulation. However, that's the first step and the next step is implementation. And I vowed in my speech on the record that I would be like a dog with a bone on this issue. I would not let it go until we did the right thing. And that's why I'm here this morning because I made that commitment. But you're so right, so many things are written down and are so good on paper, but they're useless unless we put them into effect. And that's our next challenge. Uh, at the meeting where we remembered Martin Nocton, a tireless campaigner for disability rights in Ireland, but also well known throughout the European Union. And he had challenged us, both in Brussels and Strasbourg, to do more for those with a disability. Sadly, Martin passed away just a few weeks ago, and I think we owe it to him and to his memory and to all of those who battle in this area to do the right thing and make sure that everyone is treated equally in this European Union and that we look after those who have special needs and don't deny them what we cherish, access to a home.